Hello everybody and welcome to today's Elite Dangerous live stream. As you can see, my name is Paige Harvey, I'm one of the community managers here at Frontier Developments and beside me is the stunningly beautiful oh. Stephen Benedetti. Thank you very yeah, much. Stephen. I always like when I come on with you and I say you should take the lead because <laughs> I know I'm going to get a compliment. Oh, you're going to get form. a lovely little compliment. I do enjoy a wee compliment. I'm fantastic. <laughs> um, it's Monday. Monday yep. is fun day. Monday is definitely Monday. Monday is Monday. <laughs> uh, so it's, I've had a very chilled, relaxing weekend, oh, so it's been quite nice. nice. How are you? I'm okay. I had some bad family news over the oh, weekend. Dear. Nan's not well, but, you know, see how that goes. But aside from that, yeah. finally got around to hanging up some pictures from my trip to Scotland. That's uh, always good. It's always nice. Because you've got, like, a special board or something. Yeah, you? well, uh, these ones we framed to put above the TV. Oh, that's which, nice. So it's just lots of math figuring out where to put the nails. <laughs> <laughs> Measuring tape, and you got your yeah, you know exactly. That. And then divide by this, and add that, and blah, 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 blah. so you know, got there. Blah, 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 blah. So, and it's very exciting because today I'm finally buying a fake Mark II, and it's worth the crate. And that it's was, worth the crate. That was, it was me. a very good pun. That on was your me. Part. I was really happy so with that. Why don't you shove us straight into yeah, the game? Yeah, so we'll jump straight yeah. into the game and we'll just say a big hello to everybody that is in the chat. Yes. So we just, I'm going to really struggle with this. It's uh, say hello to 07 Commander TK Shinra, uh, Ghost PBSF, Jonathan Codrington, Commander Scorpius, um, Jester D, Films by Nick, Zach Annandale, um, Commander Thatchino. Phoenix Defire, Will Flanagan, F Dev. Don't know who that is. And, and many, many more Sounds people weird. have all came. So thank you uh, very also, much Dr. for joining K. us. Ross, and I will point out. I did not see that one. I just went for the. Uh, yes, Miss. Ah, yes, Dr. K. Ross, greetings. Hello. Yes, Miss K. Sanic. It's hard because everyone starts commenting, you just run out of. Apparently, surprisingly, for the first time in my life, Paige is a bit quiet. You're quick, right? Apparently, according to these guys. Who's quiet? Why is Paige quiet? I don't know. Hold on. Oh, you, you mean like actually... Uh, yeah, I meant the microphone. Ah, right, not, okay. That, yeah. should be, that should be that better now, I believe. How's that now? Right. Uh, well, we'll find out. I've moved the mic up as well. Yeah. So now you can hear what my throat sounds like. No, I think, Hell I think, yeah. I think you can move it back down. Nope. I think I'll be okay. nope, this is where it stays. <laughs> yes, and uh, uh, 28 sleeps till Christmas. This is true. It's happening. Twenty streets. Not the first thing. We got our. We actually got our um our cards today. We, uh, sorry, our, our cards. We, our, uh, yes, our lovely boss, advent Mr. William, calendar. brought us all advent calendars. Yeah, it was and I lovely. was going to pick the one with the puppy dogs on it, but I know Stephen really likes puppy dogs, so I gave him the puppy dog one. I know that's a, that's yeah. your only and first Christmas uh, yeah. <laughs> piece of joy. I actually haven't had a. Um, I don't think it's. I guess probably been about five years or something since yeah, I've had an advent I mean, card. I don't think I had one last year, but... I've never had I've never had them. Well, now you have one. Yeah, we have, have one. work ones as yeah, well. we have work ones. It's so adorable. Thanks, Well, Really it's appreciate it. Um, two sleeps until the beta. That is true. If you do not know, we are doing a beta uh, this week for... Uh, sorry, begins this week. It's So we're sending out the information to this week. Mm -hmm. uh, it's just totally gone there. Mm -hmm. uh, and this will be for the January update. So if you don't yes. know, check over to our forums. We're going to have an announcement out this week about uh, how you can get involved. And please come and get involved because it's for some, uh, it's for those bugs that we're trying to get fixed for the January update. Yes. So that'd be fantastic. So we if you can come over and check it out, that'd be great. We're essentially lobbing some more spackle on the game and just uh, get and, it smooth it out, and make it all you. nice and smooth. And we need you guys to test it. Yeah. Because obviously there's only so much that we can test internally. We can test as much as we can, but mm -hmm. you're all in different places in the world and you've all got different connections mm -hmm. and all that kind of thing. So there's lots that only you guys can help us figure out. Yes. So, which is good times. Exactly. So. So shall we uh, get to the main I'm point of the stream? I'm gonna buy a crate. You're gonna it's buy been, a crate. It's been coming for like two months. Like I could have made this money mining very quickly, but I was. I, I don't tend to play by credits per hour because that's just boring to me. I, d I don't really care for just making money constantly. Mm. So I did lots of bits and bobs that I wanted to do. And uh, have now got seventy million. You've got that's quite a lot, it's actually. You've done quite well there. Yeah, lots and 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 lots of and data lots. missions. So I took a lot of data about <laughs> and a couple of people and got blown up a few times. And then I did go mining. Actually, I was talking to the EDC mm. uh, Discord uh, on Friday. Uh, and they were giving me some tips for mining and things like that. Yes. So oh, there we are. I'll need to go pay night mining again at some point mm -hmm. and. Uh, then I'll want to buy this ship and engineer it. So very much like um, sort of Sally's, uh, you know, P 
pink wafer mm -hmm. where she's only got the one ship and she's keeping that this is going to be mine this is going to be yours the, this yes. is the be all and end all for this and so people that haven't seen the stream before mm. you are aiming towards getting this ship to be a scavenger a scavenging ship you want yes. a scavenger yes anything. so i'm going to need to get some shields on it i know it doesn't have the best shields this ship mm. but i'm going to engineer the heck out of it everything i can but i chose this one because i really like medium ships mm -hmm. It's pretty. That that is a factor it's, for me. It's a if, I'm, ship. if I'm gonna fly it around and I'm gonna take screenshots and things, I want it to be a pretty ship. A pretty ship. Uh, I tried flying the Anaconda and the Python, the other two faves for mm. doing this kind of thing, or a Type Nine. Uh, I tried that as well, but I didn't either like the feel of them or like the the view out the front wasn't as nice as I liked. Yeah. Um, so. I decided that I'm going to go with the ship I like, and then maybe one day I can actually just go for something else. Yeah, well, that's the main thing. I think if you if you have the, I always think when you find a ship that you really want, you just keep it for a while. Yeah. Because as some of you may know, I do go through my ships quite quickly. So we've got a couple of questions in the chat. Yeah, um, feel I just free. I'm, to, I'm going to purchase it. To make sure that we've got while you're purchasing. Um, so, Shanidi, um, is FD playing a 24 hour? Xmas live stream this year. We will not be talking about any of that stuff today, but we nope. will put an announcement out about what we're doing um, for a 24 hour, 24 hour live stream this year. At some point, so keep an eye on the forums. Yeah. Um, and there's been some questions about fleet carriers, and as we've announced, we've pushed the release of fleet carriers, and it is going to be um, next year that we'll be releasing yes. them because we have prioritised um, trying to stabilise the game and do some couple of bug fixes. So if you just keep watching the forums, as soon as we find out any anything of any information on fleet carriers yes. or anything like that we will let you know but first of all we want to get the game nice and stable we want to get it in a good state so that when we do any do yes. any more releases when we do any more releases may i say or yeah. i should say um that we'll be having a nice stable game built for yeah. you so it doesn't affect anyone so that's the hope so that's what we're going for and as soon as we know we will tell you everything yeah and obviously things like fleet carriers you're going to want to play with them with your friends so we want to make sure that no, fair enough not you other people that do have friends are going to want to uh, play it with their friends and so mm. we want to make sure that the game is in the nicest possible condition and obviously that's what you guys asked us for when you were saying you wanted more stability fixes you wanted open yeah. betas so you can try these things and help us make it the best it can be yeah. so that's what we're going with and uh, hopefully it should all work out lovely and yeah. you'll see some of the you know some of the, the biggest issues for you guys fixed we've taken them off the issue tracker we've tried to look for the things that you have said need fixing yeah so you can check the forums out for what we've released so far on the open beta starting this week for the january update mm -hmm. uh, and then there will be a full list of patch notes coming soon so mm. there'll be a few more things in there so if you don't see your favorite bug fixed <laughs> yeah you might see it in there if not you might be able to get some more information on it yeah so we, we've, we've announced that uh we, we had the announcement of what was going on next week we'll have beta announcement stuff up this week we're really excited for it and yeah. as jester d said this stream is our let's play monday yes. live stream we will not do any big announcements really here predominantly if we're going to announce something we'll announce it before we'll put we'll put a dedicated stream for it um but we will talk about stuff um, we're happy to talk about that stuff but we're not going to have any cool information it is about these streams are about you know talk to you guys, let you see who we are. We want to know who you are. We want to know about you. So please, like when we say how was each other's weekend, so that, mm. join in. We want to know how your weekend yes. was. We, need to know what you, we want to know what you're doing in Elite Dangerous or outside of Elite Dangerous. I mean, we always get into conversations how I don't like cats, um, <laughs> how I baked bread. That's the new, the new thing, uh, I've baked bread. There's that. lots of really quirky things, but we want to know about you guys as well, because that's what it's about. Um, we love uh, supporting all the stuff that you guys do, and we want mm. to get to know you. And uh, Mass Killer is saying, open the betas to everyone. We are, everyone on PC can take part. We haven't got them open on console yet, but we are looking into that for you future know the ones. future upcoming betas. So if we do have those available in the future, we will let you know. Yeah. So let's have a look. So I've literally just grabbed a shield booster for the minute. I don't know what other utilities I'm going to want. So if you do have any ideas, yes. um, what I'm going to want, mostly for a scavenging ship. So essentially I need to tank up the hull quite yes. a bit and make sure it can survive being slapped while I try and steal people's diamonds. So you, you basically want to just make sure that you're fast enough? Yep. You've got enough control mm -hmm. and you've got enough strength for picking up stuff. I think yes. I've got something to make, sorry guys. Uh, so for picking up that stuff. So yeah, I mean, if anybody Ooh. knows how to make a amazing scavenging ship for Paige, please let us know. You can hit, we can uh, We can get that all sorted out um, mm. and films by Nick a rare Sunday off work so I had a Sunday roast dinner very nice fantastic I had uh, one of the best Sunday roast dinners I've had um, in the wee village that I am currently staying in mm -hmm. it's called the Rosen Crown um. oh it was delicious oh absolutely amazing 
So uh, Viking is asking, what about progress made in the beta? Will it be transferred over or lost? It will be lost. The beta server is completely separate. Your save is taken from uh, the live version of the game. We sort of snap a uh, snapshot of it a couple of weeks before it's set to go live, mm. and we use that. So anything you do will not be transferred over. So if you spend all your credits and blow up all your ships, that will not transfer to the live game. But similarly, if you grind out 10 billion credits, they will not transfer. So try and sort of focus what bits you want to try out. Yeah, and as uh, Shaniri says, what happens in the beta stays in the beta. That's, Very that is, that's what I've been going for. That's my, yeah. my, my catchphrase, I like it. Yeah. So instead of trying to grind yourself some new stuff, you mm. can just go a bit wild and try out various things. Yeah, and we're going to be releasing more so. information on the beta this week. As we said, hopefully it'll have any questions, uh, answer all your questions in that. We're going to try and put as much information as we can on. However, if you do have any questions, um, hit us up on the forum posts. Um, let us know. And um, I've had a few people come to me already and ask certain questions and try to answer them the best that we can. But some of the questions have been really good. Well, mm -hmm. not some of them. All of them been really good. So it's good to make sure that we, we get these so yeah. that if you have a problem, it's like being in school, yeah. There is no bad question. If you let us, if you have a question, we'll either try to answer it or not. So that's fantastic. Um, so let's have a look. So I'm looking at all the bits and bobs that I've got. So I've got 28 million. I know that's not going to be enough to outfit this properly. Mm -hmm. uh, it's but, quite expensive, all this stuff, isn't it? Yeah, but it's expensive. So I'm going to buy bits and bobs to get the ship working. Mm -hmm. And then I'll be able to go out using my nice new ship to continue on with some other missions to get some more money yep. and uh, go from there. So a couple more questions about the beta before we start properly kicking out the ship. Mass Killer, how do you join the beta? There is instructions on our forums. There's also instructions on the Frontier Support Knowledge Base website, and we will probably post them up on social within the next couple of days. And Spike, you do not have to grind 10 billion credits. We will actually be putting out some instructions and some guidelines and things that are better to test and you know bits that may not necessarily need testing so that you'll be able to uh, sort of have a proper look at that and have yeah. some... Uh, Places to go and things to do. Yeah, just to clarify on that, so for the beta, the announcement's not out uh, just yet. We'll be out uh, this week about what is going on in the beta, and it'll be on our forums. It'll be right there for you guys to, to see and know um, all your questions. So, for instance, the Films by Nick is asking, uh, will the prices of ships and modules be reduced? I do not believe that they are for this one. Let me double check that, um, and we will make sure that that mm -hmm. question is on. I don't believe it is because we're trying to do like a carbon copy of the game, the standard yeah. kind of practice of what we're we're playing. I think we did answer that question, but I need to double check. So let me double check, and I'll get back to that. Uh, I'll get back to you on that personally. So it's going to be fun. Uh, we're really excited, and we are going to we're going to start out. But let's get into Paige's wonderful shirt. Yes. So I'm trying to decide. So I just started having a look at the livery. We can do that last. So let's have a look. I don't need any hard points in the minute. I don't think if I have some extra power to spare, I might stick a gun just to be like, Wait, get away from me. Yeah. So I've gone with a single shield booster for the moment because I'm not sure. I may end up wanting some stuff like chaff or a point defense in case, again, people come after me after I try to steal things. I could also turn into a bit of a pirate, check out what they've got, and maybe steal it off them, but I think that will come a bit later. A bit later on. Yeah, a bit once more I've prepared. souped up the ship a bit more yeah. and understood a bit more about what I'm doing, make sure I understand how the ship moves properly and that I can, you know, get things into the cargo quickly because I'm not planning on sending out limpets for it. I plan on scooping it all oh, myself. Oh, you're just trying to scoop? Yeah, I'm going to dive my ship in, get stuff, and then run away. So, yeah, we will have a look at grabbing all these in a minute. Gonna so, take some fine pilot. Oh, so you're saying point defense by the hatch. Well, okay then, we can get some point defense by the hatch. Mm -hmm. There we are. That's good. Sorted. And I guess on the other side, what do we want on the other side? Because uh, I don't think we want two point defenses. R tell me if I'm wrong, because of course I've never built one of these ships before. I just know it's what I wanted to do. Why would you get a point defense? Uh, point defense, if you have a look. So mis it uh, protects you against missiles, so it'll automatically track missiles and torpedoes and then go pew, and help get rid of them, essentially. That's good. That is very good to have, especially yeah. if people are after you and you're trying to jump away. Yeah. Am I going to run cold or fast? Probably fast. i am probably get some... Uh, Hmm, I'll probably get some uh, heat sink launches as well just to help keep me well going essentially. I don't mind running a bit fast, I can always repair. Mm. Bit says, heavy. Place a point defense on the same side of the ship as the cargo hatch, shield booster, A rate the thrusters, rate the thrusters and FSD. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. I always... To repel the hatch break Olympics, all right. Yeah. But tell you what then, uh, so I'm going to put over here just to make it neat. We can tidy up where things go in a minute. We'll put some heat sinks here, why not? Uh, and then up here, 
we're going to put a chaff launcher just to help me lose any one that's trying to shoot at me, essentially. Yep. Oh, look at it. Look how cute. It looks like a webcam. It does kind of look, it yeah. looks like one of those kind of security, security cameras. Security cameras. Like, excuse me. Uh, I don't believe I... Actually, I might have unlocked Professor Palin. I'll have to check. But, Is it um, Palin or Palin? Palin. Palin. Palin, yes. Just don't get it with the, my accent doesn't always seem to cross over with the language of someone's name. So you're saying that I should A rate the thrusters and the FSD. I so think let's look at the FSD first. The thrusters. Oh, okay. And the A rate, no, it's, good. it's a good idea. So the chaff also looks pretty too. Well, that's good. That's helpful. Right, so I can get a 5A. Oh, spaceship vax. Thank oh, you, Striker oh, 8. Oh. So uh, I've been on some other streams and I love. <gasps> Seen when facts come out, and I love. I don't have any spaceship facts at all. So, okay. spaceship fact: July 2016, NASA's Juno probe briefly clocked in at 165,000 miles per hour, which is 266,000 kilometers per hour. Uh, the fastest. Do, don't scroll away. Sorry. The fastest spacecraft to date. That is cool. That is fast. I like. I like it. I like. Ooh. I like facts. Anyone got any more facts? Fantastic. Let me know. So I'm not going to go with the six A for now, just because although I can afford it, it'll only leave me with ten million left for the rest of the ship. Mm. So I can either go with the six B. Uh, Phoenix Fire. Five. I have said curly whirly on stream stream before. Purple curly whirly is a very hard thing to say. Curly whirly. Okay. Purple curly whirly. Purple curly whirly. Purple. Because you say purple. Like okay. like English people, I don't mean to say that badly. Like English people normally say mocking me. Purp, purple, purple. It's a purple. Oh, I can't say that. It's purple, pur, purple. Like a cat, pur. Pur, aye, purple, purple. And it makes that nice wee purple kind of sound. Um, okay, so I'm looking at either the six C or the six B. The five A just the mass is all over the place. 6A. So. So I can get to one hundred and nine Piscium for fifteen percent off all modules they stock. But I'm here now. I'm going to set it up as much as I can here, and I can always go elsewhere to get some other bits. But my plan is once I'm done here, I'm going to just practice flying the ship a bit and get over to the system of Artemis, which is my home system. Oh, but 6C. So, oh, so don't go for 6B. 6C is the same, but less weight. Ah. Well, there we go. Pete's also saying get D-rated. If you can't make it A, make it light. Yeah, I always think light's good because it gives mm. you that extra jump. Well, let's have a look at the power plant. This one, yeah, look at that, 35 mil. Ooh. So go hey. to seven, seven. You get a seven D. So you got a do to do. A do to do. A do to do. Seven D. Yeah. So there's the seven D, which is light. But then I am just looking. You know how much difference is it making? I see. Two point five. Three. Hmm. Twenty. Hmm. This. So this one. Actually, I think I prefer the B. Go for the B then. There's nothing wrong the, with B. It doesn't really affect my jump range too much. Yep. It's got better power capacity. And it's got better heat efficiency, 30% it's got more better mass. heat. It's got more it has mass, got more. It? So yeah, a light ship, faster turn rate. B rated modules are the same as C rated modules, but with more armor and more mass. So we're not too worried about that. So, so oh, you want me to do the power plant last? Okay, fair enough. So I was See, trying to do it first. There's, there's so many different up. ways to build things. Yeah, I was trying so to do it on. first. So, if we've got a 6C, why, why don't we get, that's a 5D. We could get a 60 instead. That will take the. That will go less though. Yeah, it mm. will, but that will be lighter. Lighter, better jump range. Lighter and better jump range. That's yeah, really well. You want to jump in and jump out and get get your stuff. That's the whole point, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, because as I say, I could get the 6A, mm. but that is then going to be too expensive for right Far now. Far too expensive. And then the 5A, me. Don't think we want. Okay, so guys, 5A or 6D, what do we want to go for? question. So many wheels to build ships, yet every PvP uses the same cookie cutter FDL build. I I, <laughs> I, I do. <laughs> I've got an FDL. I like it. I'm okay with that. I'm happy with it. 5A is more. Yep. But what do we want? Do we want 5A or 6 Yeah. I mean, the cash, I can I can deal with that. A rated power, a power plant for heat, yeah. 60. 60. Mass kills is 60. Five, oh, God. Oh, They're arguing. Two. They're arguing. No, we've got oh. two, two Ds, one 5A. Okay. Two sixties, two five. So which one giving me best speed? So the sixty is giving me two five two, the five a two five four. Ooh. Boost speed three four nine. Boost speed three four seven. So it's negligible. It's really negligible. But seventeen oh nine seventeen. So the five a is going to be slightly faster, but with slightly less jump. 
uh, and the 60 is going to be slightly more jump, slightly slower. So the problem I, is though the cost as well, the difference in 60 and 60. I think we're going to go for the 60. Yeah. Yeah, let's yeah. go for the 60 thrusters. We've yeah, got the 5A frame shift. More we'll, people that wanted the 60. Yeah, we've got the 4, 4D life support just to make it easier. Mm -hmm. Power distributor, do we want to do that now or do we want to do like the sensors next? See, we're, all, we're like crowd building a ship. I like it. And then all we right. need to get a name for it as well. That's right, we're gonna, we've got an idea for that. We've got an idea for that. So, you know, I was, I was actually thinking the other day when I was looking, because I was like, I could pre-build a ship and then just bring it here and just build it all together and it'll be like, you know, it'll just be me ticking boxes, but I'd rather ask everyone. Then I remembered, so... Um, Mass killer 4698 says 5A power plant. Yes. I it actually says 5A power plant. We were going to do capitalized. the power plant last um, to make sure, you know, that everything else fits in it, as mm. it were. So you're saying that the power distributor should be next. Okay. okay. So Striker Whoop. 8 has a bread fact. Now, if, if nobody knows, I made bread two weeks ago and I was very yeah. happy with it. So I posted about it and spoke about it, which I'm OK with. So bread fact, the earliest bread was made in oh. or around 8,000 BC in the Middle East, specifically Egypt. I wonder uh, what they needed their bread for. Uh, probably eating. Although, mm -hmm. I have another bread fact now. So, although the earliest bread was made around 8,000 BC, um, in Egypt, uh, a man recently was able to get hold of uh, essentially some DNA from very, very old bread and suss out the ingredients, find some old grains that were left behind in silos and things. Yeah. So he's actually been able to bake 8,000 year old bread. And, and what, what was in it? I don't, I'll see if I can find you the article because oh, he, no. he listed it all on Twitter and he showed how he made it, how he took like samples, figured out what ingredients, tried to make the old ingredients and if not, you know, supplement them with the best good. possible. Yeah, the next and thing. he's, you know, he took some cultures as well, which he's baked into the bread to try and give it the taste of 8,000 year old bread. You know, what did it taste like back then? That's quite interesting. Yeah, ah. it's pretty cool. Anyway, enough bread. So, let's have a look. I so, love bread, Yeah, D sensors for lightweight, A sensor for sensor range. We're gonna go for the A sensor, because one, it's cheap enough for me to be happy to buy. Yep. Yeah, I know, I saw it. Um, <laughs> best sensors will pick up signals further away. So we're gonna do that. We've got my sensors. We've got them. We're all sorted. Right, power dist. Woo, right. Now this is going to this is the distribution center or oh, system as we can see for the engines, the systems, and the weapons. Mm -hmm. Now I don't think I need a seven A on this, but do tell me if I am wrong. I would be tempted to lightweight this, but do tell me. My facial. Should I be doing something else? If you're seeing my facial reactions, it's because of the chat, not because of what Paige is doing. Because I realise I just went because uh, because Commander Scorpius said, add Marmite, it'll be fine oh, I to 8,000 year, uh, year old bread. So I was like... If you toast it, it'll be fine. You just bake off the old cultures. It's fine. I don't think I'd do 8,000 year old bread, to be honest with you. Yeah. Right, so, power distributor. Let's have a look. So Give it the power. You're saying you want to derate the sensors. The extra range is a bit of a luxury. You get it once you... Mm. Need an A if you're using lasers, D for everything else. I am not using any lasers. You're just so the scavenging. 70, I am just scavenging for now. If I go into it and I get killed a few times, then I might decide I need some lasers, so then I can A-rate the power dist. Yeah. Good, 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 good. Right, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. So I think we've got everything in our core. No, not we're yet. Not? The only thing oh, power plant. we've left to do is the power plant. Now, let's go down to the end, not that one. So. Let's have a look. So we're looking at around, you know, the top speed, the boost speed, and the jump. Let's have okay. a look. Two, five, four. So, doesn't, so the top speed doesn't really change. Nope, so neither the does ones. the uh, boost, which is good. So now I guess we're just looking at... Mass Killer is still saying 5A. You're pretty into that 5A. That's fair. 6A. So the 6A gives us 20 light years. What does mm -hmm. the 5A give us? Oh, yeah, 20 as well. Well, mm. then. 20.44, I'm going to take Mass Killer at his word, or her word, or their word, either way. We're going to take him at their word and uh, have a look, get ourselves a 5A. Excellent. So. Oh, so uh, Striker Hol is going on holiday if, if they're not going to be here to watch some of the streams. That's okay. Thank you very much for that. I hope you enjoy your holiday. Yes. I really need a holiday, actually. I'm at that point, it's, it's that point in the year that... I've almost been down here for six months 
And as much as I've been enjoying my job, I would love to have just like two weeks to be like, right, I need to do this or go somewhere, somewhere nice and warm or relax or, you know, have a, have a cocktail or something like that, you know, <laughs> somewhere and Las just Las Iguanas relax. just doesn't cut it anymore. Las Iguanas. <laughs> just, just sitting in. Just sitting Las Iguanas with a space heater. It's, it's done. Just like cry a wee bit. Yeah. No, I think, I think next Maybe year. You can order a drink. No, 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 that's, uh, uh, can you do that in Las Iguanas? App. I don't know, maybe. No, you do that. Most places are. No, it's just, just uh, Witherspoons. Oh, well, that in the local pub. Yeah, just go in there. But no, the, that's, that's one of the things I, I, I'm looking forward to next year. I'm going to try and get a couple of holidays in warm countries. Mm. You know? uh, I'm looking at uh, arranging a holiday for Japan, but enough of that. Yes. Back let's to keep ships. Going. So, the lightweight alloys, the. Ugh. So, mm. the only. Excuse me. The only other one I can get is this one, but that literally wipes out all of my credits. So we're not doing that because we are not going to be able to afford my insurance. No. So we're not doing that. Never fly without a rebound. So, so <laughs> we've gone for the 5A power plant. Yep. We've gone for the 6D thrusters. Yep. Gone for the 5A frame shift drive. Mm -hmm. We've gone for the 4D life support because, let's face it, if I'm starting to blow up, I just want to blow up. That's easier. Uh, 7D power dist, 6A sensors, and then obviously our standard fuel tank. Yeah. Okie doke. Now we go for the optionals. More things to look at. First, I'm going to sell all these just so I can reset it up. Da -da -da. And we're going to sell this as well. <gasps> Your fuel generator. We're going to sell it for now okay. because I'm selling everything just so we can restock we it back up and make it easier. Films by Nick wants me to A rate the thrusters. Well, let's have a look. One of the thrusters, what are we at? They're on 60 for thrusters. But that was because mm. the speed we worked at, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. No, actually, so let's have a look. I think it's because they were too expensive, the 6As. We could go 5A, uh, but I think we worked out 60 was going to be better because it was cheaper for now, and I can always get the A later. Yeah, we need to get some more money now. Yes, so we're going to stick with what we got for now. I think we've got enough to run the ship. Mm -hmm. So we're okay there. So. so we need shields, cargo, collectors, and super cruise assess, but you're not using any collectors. I'm not lo using any limpets. I'm not no. losing them all. No, I'm not using them. <laughs> I am I, I'm going to go and scoop all the things myself. Mm -hmm. That is part of what I want to do uh, because I'm, I'm pretty much going to be just like a little rat, like sat at the edge of a restaurant, like, oh my God, where are crumbs? And then I'm going to run in and get the crumbs. Like a, a rat doesn't send out limpets. But he's saying that to his children. Yeah, yeah, he's just like, go. Go with you. And then, uh, you know, death stranding, I just let them all go and ah, off right. they are. So. I don't remember death stranding ever coming out going, we have a really good effect in the game. Ah. <laughs> well, excuse me. Um, so, Dave Howarth says, why the 6A sensors wouldn't 6D be better? 6D would be lighter, but 6A has the further range. Uh, and seeing as I am trying to see as much as I can, mm -hmm. I'm going for that. Yeah, I'm yeah. going to be a space junk collector. That's literally what I'm doing. That's exactly what it is. Um, and I, Biggie Killer says this on Xbox. It is not. Uh, you're playing on PC. You just like to use an Xbox controller. Yeah, because uh, I have problems with my hands, and so I can't use a keyboard and mouse very much. Um, uh, oh, you've clicked that noise. Fantastic. I'm sure it'll be needed again. <laughs> <sighs> right. So. Let's see. So in my class, well, I've got two class six slots. Mm. One of them is probably going to be cargo so I can get as much as possible. 64. Let's see. What do we want? Let's go for a shield generator first. Do we want a size six or a smaller shield generator, people? Let me know. Depends, because you think you're going to get shot at, don't you? Quite a lot for stealing this stuff. Yeah. I mean, that's what happened last time, and that's why I'm crowd building with you guys. Uh, so we need to know what kind of shield. I would try and get a really strong shield generator if you're... For me mm. personally, if you're doing that, <clears throat> but um, I could I could get like a six A, but then I don't know whether like a six C with bi weaves would be better. Like Shan's just said, six C with bi weaves. Well, let's go for six C with bi weaves then, because that would seem to so, be. So, well, let's have a look. Get a good one, says Maskilla. I do plan on it. That's <laughs> why I'm asking. So, the six C bi weave shield generator, an alternative shield generator that sacrifices overall strength for a faster recharge. Jester D is asking a good question. Will you be scavenging on planets? Um, or mm. will you just be in space? Mostly just be in space I was planning because I, you know, it's mostly going to be where I'm going to go to battles and see where people get blown up and see if they drop anything tasty, you know, or you know, any good materials or anything like that. I so, think the 6C is good. But I'm just having a look. So whereas the regular generator forms a continually regenerating shield, the 6C 
has less strength, but recharges faster. I like uh, what uh, Orange Phoenix is saying, bi-weaves uh, will give you, uh, you can run in and charge quick and dive mm. back in, so you can kind of dive back in out. And Pete's creative set recycling says, C is too heavy, get the D. Mm. But what does it matter if it's too heavy? What does it matter if it's too heavy if I'm not necessarily going to be jumping too many places? Is it just because it will make the ship slower? Because that could be a problem. I think it would make we can have a look. Oh. Yeah. Bye weaves for the win, says Commander Nutter. Yeah. And Striker has another fun fact while we decide. Flights from London to Tokyo is anywhere from 11 to 16 hours. Well, there you go. Should I book your place now? Sorted. <laughs> Did not expect that, and I read it out. I should have read 11, that before. 11 to 16 hours. That's actually pretty good. That's yeah. not bad. Well, there's four places I want to go in Japan. I'm going to buy this bye weave while we're here. Go for it. Um, so I, there's uh, Nara Park. Mm -hmm. which is with the, with the deer. Everybody, yeah. Everyone goes there, Everyone but yeah, I want to go there. Um, I want to go to Fox Island. Okay. Island full of wild foxes. They're all really friendly. Sounds great. Then there's Rabbit Island, which is not on Fox Island because they'd all be dead. Yep. So Rabbit Island, which is separate. And then there is a dog theme park. Why don't you just get an animal? I, I have animals, oh. but I, <laughs> I really want to go and meet some bowing deer, and I want to go to Fox Island and pet all the foxes. I want to go to Rabbit Island and pet all the rabbits. I think Dr. K. Ross wants to come with you. She does. She's subtly, she, she she's subtly, loves subtly hinting at the fact that um, she would probably be all right if you invited her. She'd be happy yeah, with it. She'd make well, time for you. We'll, we'll have a look. We'll have a look. <laughs> and then, yeah, so, ooh. Muska is saying get the 7A. I cannot get a 7A. I hate the idea of cat cafes. It's yeah. like my worst nightmare. I love cafes and I hate cats. Well, they have them in Edinburgh, so... And they have one in Glasgow. We'll, we'll go to Glasgow. I'll come to Glasgow with you and uh, we're going to go to a cafe. I'm not going to Gremlin like, because it'll come near me and I'll be like, eh, and I'll be drinking my coffee and I'll be like, yeah. No, you do, do not punt the cat with oh, the I'm coffee. Like, the coffee after no! Okay. okay. Um, Stephen, where do you want to go for holiday? I was thinking somewhere like... So I've got friends in Barcelona and Tenerife. Um, but I was thinking somewhere kind of... I don't know why, like Spanish? Something somewhere like Spanish-ish. Well, I think it's pretty close to, you know, where yeah. we live now, just with a different language. Well, that's what I like. I, it's so very I'm, simple. I've been quite interested. I, I like the kind of, like, Spanish music and the feel and stuff like that. I was thinking about maybe going somewhere that has that kind of ideology and feel mm. and stuff. Or, you know, that's somewhere warm to go to and, and see, see about that. Oh, I was thinking wow. somewhere there. The, well, uh, that would go to have, to have to go to Hawaii for that. No, nah, so that's Hawaii. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I'm going to take the thumbnail for this later. I was both doing... No, you have to go the same way as me. Oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That'll be the thumbnail. All right, we're thumbnailed. <laughs> yeah, no. Perfect. Um, so, hold on. Before you continue, we've got the 6C by... Shush. We've got the 6C by wheel shield generator. Mm -hmm. And i got a 6C cargo rack. That's good. So now I have... Cargo space, That's excellent. Awesome. I doubt I'm ever going to need more than 64 if I'm just jumping in and out and stealing things. So I've got all this space. What do I want? I mean, yeah, I probably will get a Super Cruise Assist because I like to play while I'm working. I don't know why Will isn't here still. But I like to play while I'm working. So I just uh, set my ship to go while I go and work. I used to do that and then I got the PlayStation 4 taken off of me. <laughs> it's just around the corner now. I was like, That's I'll why I play on PC. I know, because it's so much easier. <laughs> Uh, anyway, I was, I was too busy talking. Uh, flight sis. So the Zach said, uh, I'd plunk on a couple of uh, OE shield boosters yep. engineered up for heavy duty shields and super capacitors. Ah, very nice, Kazakh. That's a good idea. Um, so we're going to just grab a super screw assist. We don't need a docking computer. So Fine got, with that. Got a question of saying, uh, how about pu Puppy Cafe? Puppy would Cafe would be amazing. Puppy Cafe would be the would be amazing. Puppies smell so good. Yeah, puppies do. Please. I like, I love They've this got smell. puppy smell. Puppy smell. Um, I Big Killer says, uh, is bounty hunting hard? It's not hard. Um, it's, it's just like everything. It takes a wee bit of time to practice, to get into. You start learning eventually what to do. You need to let your pips control, your speed. Um, it's just another part of the game. It takes a bit of time. It's not hard. Um, if you start off nice and easy and get a decent enough shit, um, and there's a lot of help out there, and the community is great to help you out with that mm. as well. Um, and to do that, so it's just another different fun place now. I wouldn't say so, anything in Elite Dangerous is hard after you practice and kind of get into it for a while. It, it is challenging, um, but I wouldn't say anything's like impossible. It's not like beat hard beating a boss or something like yeah. that. It's, it's something that you can start doing quite easily and build up from there and practice. Okay. So. Okay, don't forget your collection limpets. I'm not, not getting, getting collector collection limpets. limpets. No limpets for me. No. Okay, uh, so we've got a generator, we've got this. Right, let's have a look. What can we get in here? 
Let's have a look at the options. So don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need that, don't need, oh, may, might need that, no, 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 maybe, no, yes, maybe, mm. no, 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 get out of here, recon. Yeah. So uh, what would you recommend for a new player, says Ivy Killer, if you were doing bounty hunting? Um, what I would do is the best ship that I got is quite affordable as the Vulture. That was the first one. Or the Viper. Uh, if you want to go shooting. Yes, or the Cobra Mark III. Yes, Cobra uh, Mark III. Cobra Mark III is else. probably, they, they were my two favourite ships to go there because Cobra Mark III is kind of an all-rounder as well. It's good. Uh, and then basically find find the station that you like. Um, if you want to do bounty hunting, it's quite good to find res sites. Mm -hmm. um, or you can do some of the bounty missions. If you're wanting to start off, I'd say probably do some of the bounty missions because there'll be different levels and you can pick them to your level. Um, and then get um, make sure that you've got some lasers to get shields down and multi cannons for yes. the hulls. Always um, have a thermal and then always have something for, so thermal will help you take out shields. Yep. And then you want to go for something for just grinding down that hull. <laughs> And also, um, I, right now, because of certain skill levels as well, I use Gimbled because yep. I find it a bit easier. I prefer Gimbled. Um, so Gimbled is good because it will lock on for you. It might not be as strong as the as the, um, as the fixed, but they're still really good because you'll hit them more often. So that's a good way to start off. But also, we've got a wonderful community. Go check out our forums. There is sections that are dedicated to combat mm -hmm. and fighting, and we've got great people out there, and they're very welcome. We've got to get on on Discord, um, the forums, and... Uh, and that stuff and you can talk to people there to help you out mm -hmm. very much so yeah. right so not seeing too many more suggestions on what we need so do i want hull reinforcement and module reinforcement i mean is that going to be necessary right now like maybe a fuel scoop or an amfu says pete's creative mm -hmm. recycling however yeah i don't know i'm going to see how i get on without those things and i can always get them later clap um <laughs> Perfect. That's, that's my thinking clap of just what? Come on, what else nah. is there? My oh, clap. fabulous! I get bored sometimes. <laughs> I just sit I, myself. Yeah, fair enough, mate. Fair enough. So, uh, the, so the Kazakh Kazakh said one small hull reinforcement in the size two slot engineered for heavy duty. Okie dokie. Uh, oh. And then Pete's creative recycling said no reinforce needed as your modules are useless without a hull. That, yeah, 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 that makes sense. And uh, while I'm not going to be in combat, necessarily, I may still be getting shot. That's the thing. You're That's not, why I want you're to... You're not fighting, you're, um, you need to be evading and getting out of there. Uh, fuel scoop is always worth it, says Dave Worth, and I agree. Um, there's been many times I've been jumping and I forgot to apply. Uh, well, all right, we'll scoop. put a little baby one on. We'll put a baby one on. Baby one's even better, like baby. even just a, a small light one. We're going to put a 3A. Yeah, I mean, that just basically is good if you're out somewhere and you wanted. So there's a lot of stuff there you could jump out and jump Just in case. Yeah, just just in, case. in case. We'll get that. So we'll put a little little 3A in there. Quick okay. for saying, uh, yeah, an op are you an open or are you going after NPCs? We normally on these streams play, uh, it's our own account, so it's actually entirely up to you. Yep. But because everybody knows where we are, sometimes it gets a bit competitive and a bit <laughs> difficult and... Watching us cry on stream sounds fun, but it's really not. Um, so yeah. we wouldn't that happen. And plus, Paige is very wrathful, and if you came after her, um, she would come after you with a vengeance. So we've asked her uh, to play on <laughs> close. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Solo. Uh, Shan says, are there uh, any plans for a Black Friday sale for ship skins, etc.? Well, who knows? Check out the stream. You just have to wait and see, won't you? I don't know what the eyebrows are doing. Kind of like me, maybe, maybe, mm. maybe, 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 maybe. Well, I have my ship moved to Beagle Point. No, this is uh, oh, my personal be, account, be, be, so I ain't getting moved anywhere. I moved myself. I was just singing well in a uh, shanty song. Ah, well, that's fine. To Beagle Point. Be <laughs> If you haven't gotcha. seen our streams where that happens, you can watch uh, on YouTube. We've got a bunch of our other streams. We've got different stream series and other Let's Plays, and all of our announcements and information are on there. Check it out. So. Uh, Pete was okay. saying basically, if I'm not going to get other stuff, um, maybe I should. Stuff. No, no maybe stuff? I should get a stronger shield. Which, mm, yes, I mean I can't afford the six A now, but let's have a look. So we could get a six B. That does take my speed down, not my. Oh no, not really. I think you're fine with the six C. Like, give it a go and see how it goes. Yeah, I'm quite liking Thanks, the bi wheel. Bi, bi, bi wheel. 
bi the bi-wheels. The bi The shield. bifrost shield generator. The, the bi Close the bifrost. So we're going to take this out, which is good. I may end up getting a fighter hanger just in case I'm like, oh, I want to go fight something. Yeah. So well, well this fun. is the basics. We now we're, we're going to want to go and see what we can scavenge. Yes. So now we do have another thing left to do. Ooh. It's the livery. One more now we time. have to decorate the ship. So these are the paint jobs I have. Let us look. So we have mm -hmm. the uh, special, special effect, effect, the Christmas paint job. It's quite good because it's almost at that time of year. It is. It is. But then we have the precision, in Those case we want. Yeah. Uh, then we have the precision in green. Oh. Not fan, I don't think. But I like Graphite. this one. This one's very nice. Then we have this one, but that just makes you stand out a bit too much. Yeah, you want to be subtle. Uh, you quite, yeah, then there's the, uh, the precision gray. Or there is the banana. The banana? Banana. -na. I don't think that's the color. I think I'm going with this one, but I may end up getting like one of the Crypsis ones at some point. Uh, the middle Ooh, one is my fave out of those, says Aramis. Ooh, Ooh I like this one. <laughs> Great, Scott. I like that. <laughs> that, is, that needs to be the name. It's not, no. That needs to be no, the name. No, we're not Tom Beaven, that is my favorite name. Great, Scott. <laughs> oh, I love that. Terrible. Yeah. No. Oh, oh, what's that? A discount on the Crate MK2 Raider pack. I guess you should go to the store oh. and have a look. Oh, well, let's let's have a look. What what have we got in here? Oh, oh look, they're both on sale. Perhaps, Shan, perhaps there is a Black Friday sale. Mm. Perhaps it's just gone live and yeah. I did not know. Yeah. Perhaps you should go check it out. So, there you go. So, Shinies! So we need to, you picked the paint, paint job. No. Let's pick, pick the paint job. All right. Pick the paint right. job and let's get uh, some banana. Banana. No, we're not going banana. I'm Ooh. thinking this one myself. I quite like this. Little pink stripes remind me of Sally, Go which is it. nice. I saw a lovely picture of Sally. She was in, she was out exploring yeah. with her newfound friends, which is lovely. Not felt betrayed at all. <laughs> uh, I've been replaced. My old uh, uni friend works with Sally and I've been replaced as a token <laughs> Scotsman. But he doesn't count because he's done Dorian. So That's right then. So I'm still better. Right. So I think, yeah, we'll go with the, the pink weapons and the pink thrusters so it all matches. Archer is... Oh, no, go away, Celeste. Mm -hmm. Hey, look! Discounts on uh, Kovas as well. Mm. Decent. Anyway, I'm going with Archer because he's my favourite. Decals! Front decal. I have assorted decals. So cannon, combat. Great enthusiast. <laughs> like Gamescom. <laughs> skull. You know, because everyone needs a skull. Is there anything that is kind of uh... beta tester? Oh, that's good. Packs. I do like the packs one. Oh, I don't nice. know. It's just a good shape. Um, yeah, Yuri Grom. Ah, serious. Well, I don't really do power play, but I do like some of their. Uh, Decals. Some of the decals, it's yes, nice. they are quite nice. Uh, bird. Arisa Lavini. Bird. I think. Bird. There we are. Frontier Expo. Oh, that's a nice Frontier one. Expo emissive. Ooh. Shiny one. I think I'm just going to go with the X so when people shoot me, they know where to shoot. Yeah, that's a good point. That works. All right. Hello there, General Kenobi. Ship kits. Now, I don't have a ship kit, but so. I probably will get one. Nameplate. Now I have many nameplates because it is very important for me to put on my uh, my name. Mm -hmm. So let's have a look what we got. So we'll pick a plate and then we'll put a name on. Mm. Uh, that's a bit too fancy. A bit too fancy, fancy for what we're doing now. That, this one's okay actually. Yeah. I quite like this. It's pretty good. That's nice and subtle. Yeah, but it's yeah, it's barcode. Fair enough. What else we got? We've got the stars. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Wings. What are these? No, no, not quite right. We're getting there, but we're not quite right yet. Explorer. No, we're not exploring. We're just stealing things. That's that's a good one then for that, because that looks like oh, you're jumping in good. and jumping out. I quite like this one. Zoom. <laughs> People chasing me as I steal their things. That's good. That's Please good name one. it Alan. Why do, why do I want to name it Alan? Give me a reason. Tell what, me why what, it should be named I want to know what your name, name is. Uh, um, I'm going to get there. 
If it's, if it's not as good as Crate Scott, it's going to be Crate Scott. It's, it's not Crate <laughs> it Scott, It needs mate. to be Crate Scott, because if it's not as good, then it needs to be. <laughs> Just like, Alan is super cool. End of. Uh, mm. Yes, we're just going to go with the classic ones. All okay, right. Okay, so we're going for the name now. All right, okay. Mm. It's not as good as Crate Scott. We need to use Crate Scott. Mm, we're not using Crate Scott. I'm not, having, Crate I'm Scott. not having it. I'm it's, not it's, it's having like it. It's an amazing, amazing name. Crate Cookies? No, 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 no. No. Greatest. Um, mm. no. <laughs> it's the greatest of all time. <laughs> Crate Scott uh, is just better. Uh, it's not Crate. You can get it's one and better. you can call it Crate I'm saying it's better. Well, then you are welcome to get one and call it Crate Scott. Can anybody come up with a better name than Crate Scott? And if it is better, then it should be called Crate Scott. I want a name which uh, is, you know, cheeky and you can go in, like Steely, Rats, you know, that kind of thing. The Crate Escape? That one's pretty good, actually. That's no, quite good, actually. I'm actually yeah. really happy that yeah, I came that, one, that one's pretty good, actually. Yeah. That's pretty good. Uh, Anyone want to vote for the Crate like, Escape? And there's like Crate Expectations. Oh, Crate Expectations yeah, is good. That one's all right as well. Crate um, Expectations is nice. Um, um, <coughs> that was the most British thing we've ever done, both of us just going, um, um, what, kind of, what, else is, what else can we get for a crate? So, um, something that's steely. Yeah, something that's, yeah, something that's steely. Something that would just jump in and take it away. Creepy crate. Creepy. Uh, fun fact, just remember that Steggs can make an impressive Obi-Wan Kenobi impression. Well, that's very impressive. He has a Scottish thing, but I don't know if it's, it's, I don't know if it's Obi-Wan. I need to double check. I think, he, I think he's done it before. I think I did enjoy it. I did enjoy it, actually. Hmm. Thunder Thund Cookie. Why does everyone say cookie? I don't get it. I mean... Crate Balls of Fire. A crate name. Yeah. Crate Balls of Fire. Crate Scott or nothing. Nothing. No, Crate <laughs> Scott was so good. Oh, God. It's, um, no, it's Crate not Crate Scott, because as soon as somebody steals your, you steal their stuff. Who stole the stuff? It's Crate Scott. <laughs> Actually, there is a reason. That, huh? So, one of my, so when I was in college, um, I used to, uh, I used to study uh, Greek mythology, mm -hmm. and there is the story of the Cyclops uh, who uh, got stabbed in the eye, and he, the guy that stabbed him earlier told him that his name was nobody. So when he got stabbed, and all the other like Cyclops ran over and went, "What's wrong, Polyphemus? What's wrong?" He went, "Nobody stabbed me." So they went, "Well, shut up then," ah. and they all laughed and buggered off because nothing had happened. Nobody had stabbed him. And so nobody has stolen your things. Ah, okay, okay. This is the nobody, because be nobody, nobody has stolen your things. Would it not be no one? No, it's nobody, because that's the name of the person. I know, but for yeah. this, would it not be no one? No, no. no one stole my stuff. No, well, because I'm still flying the ship, so nobody stole it. Mm, I still think Crate Scott is better. Crate Scott is good. Oh, look at the plant. I do need the plant. I need to get myself a plant. I'm not happy with the plants. I, oh, I always kill them. Plant. See, that just scares oh, me. Imagine, imagine the cacti was in your ship and it flew off and hit you. That would be really, really yeah. disappointing, wouldn't it? I'd be a bit more worried the about having The cheese crater. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> cheese crater is pretty good. If I get a combat crate, I'll call it the cheese crater because mm -hmm. that's a good one. I've got, oh, little bobbly viper. Okay. Little bobbly man. Ugh, he's too bobbly. His neck's broken. Bobbly. Uh, bobbly. Oh, no, she's too broken as well. She's very bobbly as well. Ah! They're really All right, it. that's fine. Uh, Put snowflakes. on a really snowflake and a, and a snowman. Oh, uh, okay. Because it's Christmas time. It's not Christmas, mate. It's Christmas. Oh, All right, almost... fine. We'll put a snowman on. And uh... then, like, I don't know, here we're going to put on... Oh, oh I've got a tree. Christmas tree as well. I bought a Christmas oh, tree. Oh, God, the tree's broken. No, uh, uh, fine, fine. Um, hold on. Oh, uh, Christmas tree. Fine. You know what? I'll just do a Christmas corner. Yeah. So... Is yeah. everybody ready for their lovely Christmas? Have they got everything sorted of you, Paige? Have you got I haven't got a dress for the Christmas party. Not the other. Do you have your dress for the Christmas party? <laughs> no, I'm wearing my kilt. I so, yes, you do. I've got my dress. Oh. It's, it's a kilt, it's not a dress. Oh. You cannot call a dress a kilt. Just jealous. No, I, um, did, I did see a man when I was in Edinburgh wearing a kilt, and I was like, yeah, that's pretty cool. It does look good. Right, there we are. That's it. We have built a ship. We are all tricked It's out. shiny. It has a name. So now we need to go and try and scavenge something. 
Well, no, um, now I'm actually going uh, to get myself set up in my home system. Ah, as we're recording, yes. Because I want to start from there so that I can always get back to where I'm going. So we are going to, again, in my love of Greek mythology, we are going to the system of Artemis. Luckily, it's pretty close. How many jumps? Uh, six. Six jumps, that's not too bad. Nice and easy. Yeah, we'll make it there. Yes, definitely. Definitely. A, Pete's creative perception is there is a Western movie named The Man Named Nobody in it. Nobody ah. was a faster draw. Oh. That's pretty good. That's quite a good one. So again, thank you for ah. tuning into the. Oh, what's there going we on? Go. Oh. I was just in the ceiling. Don't worry. Nice. Thanks there for tuning into is. the Let's Play live stream and with this amazing input, you've now got this fantastic ship together, don't you? Yeah. So, uh, is my ship a multi-role? So kind of. So. It's got a decent-ish jump range. It will be better. So I could use it as like a mini explorer if I wanted to get somewhere. So I should be able to get around quite easily. It's a family car type deal. You know, it's not incredible, but it does what it needs to. It has USB ports, as you can see. <laughs> so I can plug in my phone and charge it as I go. Perfect. Uh, USB-C by the look of it. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> um, and then I... Uh, yes. So And then it's going to be mostly for scavenging. So it's mostly going to be tanky mm. so not necessarily combat uh how can we tell how many jumps big killer because let's get out of camera mode yep there it says it up the top so yep. whoop, that way up there says six jumps to artemis so you can yeah you can see system and it's got next jump but i don't know how many it is yeah i should probably leave yeah probably kill me. Th three hours three, th three hours three minutes and 50 seconds until you get uh it's cool. fine oh the whispering migration Ooh. what a name did you undock and will soon be evacuated from the premises? Uh, well, I have undocked. I won't be evacuated. I'm just going to fly this out of here. Mm -hmm. There we go. Will I be going to the party as a true Scotsman, Stephen? Uh, I will... You know what I'm like. I'll leave that to you if you think I will or won't. That's a yes, then. <sighs> I will not be wearing my outfit during the we'll day. We'll keep work. you away from the free bar. <laughs> no, <laughs> that can't happen. You'd have there to, have, you'd have, to have... All my Christmas bobbleheads are just... Yay. Oh, they're good. <laughs> They're really excited. Donk. Yeah, um, you'd need an army to keep me away from the free bar. Yeah, all right, fair enough. Uh, or, did, just, or just dogs, like six dogs. That I just play with them. Yeah. Uh, did did Paige fit a fuel scoop? I did. did. I she did. did. She got a wee mini fuel, fuel scoop. Yeah. So still got thirteen million, which is good. I have a squadron. Mm -hmm. Don't think anyone's in it. All good. Uh, I would have joined, but it's got cats. Oh. So. It doesn't have cats. It says cats. Oh. Oh wait, yeah. Right. I forgot. I think your plan was to click all the cats no, for the universe. No, so uh, my squadron is set up with uh, the roles being like top cat and things like that. Yeah. Which is I, it's pretty good. It is clever. It is very clever. It just yeah. goes against my... Yeah, so we're the cats in space. Uh, we haven't really done anything yet because it's just me. But <laughs> if you want to be we... part of the cats in space squadron, you can join in. Yeah. Uh, uh, yes, pretty much that's it. Yeah. We, uh, we what don't is your really ultimate goal? On. As the have fun. Right. So my ship could be better. There are too many people screaming about A grading. Well, that's why we haven't A graded everything because yeah. A grading everything is not the answer. So as you can see, we've got Ds, we've got Cs, we've got As, we've it's got also a couple expensive, of the A grade stuff. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so I think we're okay with most things. Like we've got some extra power usage, which is great. Um, mm. I'm going to be working on ranking something up to elite. Mm -hmm. I'm sort of, this is what I've done casually. I haven't actively tried any of these things. Mm -hmm. So like broker, that will, that will rank up soon. I'm getting there. You know, CQC, meh. Pathfinder, cool. Just going to keep doing that as we yeah. go. Uh, and mostly harmless as well. Yes. Keeping going, keeping That's going. not too bad. So we've got, this question's came up twice by Corpse Necromus. It says, is there any plans on adding a raider kit for the Alliance Chieftain? Um, they've asked previously. It's going to be passed to right people. If uh, if it has been said that it's been passed on to right people, it has been. Mm. We've got nothing to announce for it just now. Um, and if there's nothing as of yet, we'll let you know when that happens. Mm. But it will have been passed on sometime soon. We can, we can poke around and see what they say. But um, if, if there's not been any information out yet, we don't have any information just now. Um, so sadly, they have to never play on Xbox. We don't have an Xbox kit. We do, we do have an Xbox. But no, but like next to the desk. No, so that's true. We, sorry, it is next to the desk, but we just don't go on it. So because um, so these live streams are our own account, mm -hmm. this is my, my account. Uh, myself and Will both 
have a PlayStation 4. So like Sunday I was playing Elite Dangerous. So but yeah. I'll play it on my own account and then I'll, and I'll bring it on in here. But you actually play on PC, that's why you yes. do it on PC. So until we get somebody, and you never know, the new community manager who we're, we're looking for might play on Xbox, then we'll, they'll be on Xbox. Yes, very yeah. much so. But yeah, I, I like to play on PC because I have uh, at home, I have my PC hooked up with a HDMI splitter between my computer mm. and my TV. So it's just much easier to just like sort of flop on the sofa with a cat on your blanket and a cup of tea and play Elite Dangerous on the TV with a pad. Mm. Which is good times. Yeah, just look, look, I've got a scoop. It's scooping. It's scooping stuff. We're going to Sickians. I was like the scoop. I'm gonna jump to Sickians. Extremely, extremely hard. You can do this. How many more jumps? Two, three, four. There you go. Oh, four. we can check. Four. See? How handy is that we feature? It's there lovely. we go. But yeah, if, uh, if you guys enjoyed the stream today, um, thank you for your help again. Yes, just, thank you very staff. much. I'm enjoying We're myself. We're finally in the ship. We're in the and ship. And as you can see, this is why I picked this one, because look, the view is so nice. The windows, the way it's all designed, yeah. it's all centered, because I hate being in the ship where it's like the seats over there. Yeah. It's one of the problems I have with actually fly, uh, flying cars. That is a problem flying with cars. Uh, driving cars, just because I'm sort of like, oh, I'm at the side. Oh, God. Uh, so. Yes. Hey, look, so, I found Eden. So, never get in a car with you. Oh, well, I don't have a license yet. So. Uh, no, that's why I'm not. Um, oh, gosh. Oh, no, fine. Uh, with the emergency stop, I think... Uh, that's all right. I'm going to get myself uh, over to Artemis. Mm -hmm. And then I'm sure I will post some pictures on Twitter and things like that of uh, my scavenging. Yeah. And hopefully, I will be able to get myself... A low temperature diamond after the nightmare that happened last time. Oh, yeah, that's a good story. If you've not heard that story, it's a very good story. I'll tell it next time. Uh, Shrike, what's your Instagram? My Instagram is thebenedetti117. I don't remember what mine is. Yeah, I remember it. Mine's is that. I, think, my, that. I think mine's page underscore Khajiit underscore Harvey. It's so difficult. Yeah, I know. It's because all the normal names I had were taken, but yeah. I'll change it soon. Wait, no, it's not. It's Arthramis. I remember. A R T H. R E M I S. Yes, exactly. So, what we'll do is we'll just jump back to the main. And thank you very much for joining us in Let's Play. Again, I just want to reiterate the beta announcement will go out this week. We'll be on our forums. Mm. Um, it'll be on Steam and it'll be on our forum place. We'll announce that we're doing the beta stuff. Um, so, if you want to check that out, um, it's going to be really exciting. We're really looking forward to doing this open beta with everybody. Mm -hmm. All the information is there. Please uh, join in and help us uh, with this. Yes. And if you have any questions, we're going to be posting up about it and we're happy to, to answer anything that we can. Yep. And we've got a really exciting live stream this Thursday um, with Paige. Hello. And special guests. Yes, and um, possibly this man. Possibly me. We'll possibly Stephen. I'm, I'm trying to get in, but they might... Might kick him out. Might kick him out. Um, so, and if you've got any questions about any of the Black Friday sales, go over to our store um, and we'll have any announcements and information yep. on that there. And I'm sure if you are signed up to the emails, you'll get a lovely little email into your inbox yes. if we have anything uh, fun. Yes, exactly. I'm sure you'll just have to wait and see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. <laughs> but yes, guys, thank you so much for joining in on the live stream. We'll see you later on um, and be safe out there. Yes, see you later. Bye. Bye.